Hello everyone, this is me, Sadia here, and I'm back with the remaining month of December reads start from the 22nd through the 31st of December 2023. This reading is going to be for the sign of uh, Gemini. So Gemini, let's see what's coming in for you for the remaining month of December time. I will be adding a lot many cards here in this reading, so stay tuned and before I dive into the read, let me remind you, it's a general reading, Hitman, it may not resonate with everyone out there. Pick whatever resonates and leave the rest. So, yeah, let's see what's coming in for you for the mo remaining month of December. Let's see. Gemini. Healer of the Ages. The Sun. And Dota Romance. Underneath the deck, we do have Dota Spirit. Wow. I really feel like, you know, um, the remaining month is going to be like um, a, a phase of your life where you're going to be um feeling a very strong connection with the divine um i really feel like maybe something has happened in your life in recent times which has made you think of your life in a different and a very fresher perspective um i really feel like you know you are more aligned with what you desire you're more aligned with the god that you believe in you're more aligned with the divine intuition as well I really feel like, you know, um, for some of you, you might have been trying to heal yourself or heal your heart in the recent times from a breakup, from something that didn't work well for you. And you are kind of like, you know, picking up the pieces and trying to move on, move forward with something as well for some of you. But I really feel like, you know, it's, it's the time and phase of your life where you're trying to heal your heart completely. And um, you are trying to kind of like, you know, uh, set some new goals, set some new uh, wishes and, you know, for, for yourself to achieve probably in the year 2024. So I really feel like, you know, the, the remaining month of December is going to be the time where you are going to be like um, letting the past go. You're going to try your best to heal your heart from whatever experiences that you've had. And you would try to walk into the month, the next year, um, with with a lot of positivity with a lot of excitement with lots of uh expectations uh around your love work and home life i really feel like you know um for those of you who are you know uh dealing with a specific someone right now i really feel like you know there's something which is kind of like you know gonna heal your connection with someone specific uh, during this remaining month's time. I feel like, you know, maybe you have uh, struggled a lot in recent times to, to make things work in your connection uh, with your specific someone. But I really feel like, you know, you are connecting to the divine that you believe in and you're trying to manifest uh, what you desire with this person. You're trying to manifest a reconciliation. You're trying to manifest the strong bond between you and this person again. So I really see you very connected to, to the divine intuition, which is going to help you a lot in the remaining month time to create the life that you desire uh, for yourself and for your connection with this person. So I really see that for some of you, you might be able to heal your connection in the remaining month time with a specific someone and start a new chapter with them in the remaining month time itself. And uh, you walk into the next year with a lot of positivity and romance, um, you know, um, in your life with this person. So I really see a shift happening, taking place in your life uh, for good. Uh, even if you have ended something and you're trying to move forward, there is a lot of positivity that you are having towards the future. You're having positive expectations. And if you are with a specific someone, I really feel like, you know, for some of you, you might meet someone in the remaining month's time as well, where uh, that person is going to help you heal your heart and is also going to add a lot of positivity and sunshine back in your life with a lot of romance to offer, with a lot of spirituality to offer in the connection that you have with this person. So I really see for some of you, there might be some sort of a spiritual connection that you're going to be having with someone specific in the remaining month time it's a new connection in that situation is i is what i can pick up because i really see somebody coming in your life maybe this person has long hair black hair uh this person could be tall good built um whether feminine or masculine uh but but they will have a very you know um uh very um perfect kind of a you know um persona and i feel like you know this person is going to be like somebody who's going to be adding a lot of fun in your life somebody who's going to be adding a lot of excitement in your life so i really see the remaining months to be a very positive uh boost um in your life overall let's see what else is coming in for you in the remaining month of uh, <clears throat> december time gemini what else is coming in for you for the remaining month of uh, december time I really 
feel like you know this is going to be a perfect time where you are going to be like uh having a lot of clarity coming your way as well again maybe that's like you know why you are in very in touch with the divine as well where you are kind of like you know grabbing some information coming from the divine that you that you wanted to have that you wanted to see uh, I really feel like, you know, for some of you, you, you will be intuitively so heightened in the remaining month's time that you will be able to pick up signs and messages coming from the divine very easily without any, put, without any put, you know, without putting any effort as at all. I really feel like, you know, you are going to be valued. You are going to be loved. You are going to be cherished by people around you in the remaining month's time. And it's all because you are healing your heart. You are healing your soul. Uh, maybe there is somebody out there who's going to help you heal your heart and heal your soul. Um, for some of you, it might be a mentor who's going to enter in your life, who's going to help you heal your heart, and then you will be opening yourself up to 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 the you know the new love and new abundance in your love life. But I really feel like you know, um, for some of you, if you are with someone specific in your life right now, and there has been some issues that you were dealing with, the divine is going to protect that connection and. Um, that connection from falling apart uh, for some of you could be dealing with an aries aquarius or a cancer as well but i really feel like you know um there is a closure coming to something specific and then there is a new beginning that i start uh that i see starting for you as well uh for some of you could be dealing with another gemini as well but i really feel like you know there will be a lot of communication taking place between you and a specific someone there's a lot of um uh, help coming from the divine to heal your heart and to move you forward in the right direction in the remaining month time as well. So um, let's see, last few cards of the read. Let's see what else is happening for you in the remaining month time. Knight of Wands, Strength. The high priestess again your in your intuition is going to be heightened there's a lot that is going to get revealed to you as well be that in a relationship work life home life but i really see that it's all happening because your connection with the divine is very strong right now in the remaining month's time it's it's more like you're going to feel more connected you're going to feel more in alignment you're going to feel more at peace from within as well uh, i really feel like you know um for some of you, maybe you are trying to manifest something in, in your life right now, and uh, which is the reason why you're going to be spending a lot of time with yourself and the God that you believe in. That's that's strengthening the not just the connection that you have with someone specific, but also the God that you believe in. But also, it is also making you realize that you have more potential that you ever realized to create the life that you wanted, to create the life that you desired for yourself. I really feel like you know this is going to be the time when you are going to be like spending either with a specific someone or with yourself and the divine that you believe in, because you really want to heal yourself up uh, to the point where you don't um, waste your time and energy mingling with the you know people, situations, uh, which are not going to be beneficial for you in any possible way. I really feel like, you know, there might be some people interested in you, but you're not going to be like willing to give your energy to them. So you might be kind of like, you know, staying aloof uh, in the remaining month time, trying to heal your heart, trying to heal your connection, trying to heal yourself. So you could walk into the next year uh, with more energies, with more positivity as well. So, um, yeah, that's uh, pretty much it coming up for you for the um, remaining month of uh, December time. And um, if it was of help, do like, share and subscribe. And till I do the next read for you guys, take care. And if you're willing to purchase uh, affirmation set from me for the new year, you can check the description box for that. Till I do the next read, take care. Bye.